हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज चिन्मय देश पांडे इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट अ टॉपिक फ्रॉम सॉल्यूशन ऑफ लीनियर साइमल्टेनियस इक्वेशन हियर वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व अ न्यूमेरिकल ऑफ गॉस जॉर्डन मेथड सो वी हैव टेकन अ सेम न्यूमेरिकल व्हिच वी हैव सॉल्व इन अ गॉस एलिमिनेशन मेथड लेट्स सी द इक्वेशन इज 2i1 i2 3i3 8 i1 i2 i3 8 and 3 i1 plus i2 minus 4 i3 equal to 0 now in case of gauss jordan method no need to do any partial pivoting so directly we will write it in a augmented format we will write these equations in the augmented format so i will write it as let's see the augmented matrix will be so what is augmented matrix here we are going to write it as a and b so if you see the first coefficient of i1 is 2 minus 1 3 minus 1 2 1 3 1 and minus 4 with the constant values as 8 8 and 0 now first what we will do first we have to uh, we have to make this first element that is 2 as a 1 so let me write it as step number 1 we have to change in a r1 and we will be taking help of r1 itself so r1 equal to r1 by 2 let me write these elements as it is minus 1 2 1 3 1 -4 1, 1, 1. here also this 8 will be as it is this 0 will be as it is so when you divide it what you will get 2 by 2 is 1 minus 1 by 2 is minus 0.5 3 by 2 is 1.5, 8 by 2 is nothing but a 4. Now, in a step number two, what we have to do? We have to make these two elements as a zero by taking help of this element. So I am going to write it as we need to do, or we need to do changes in a R2. So that's why I am writing it here as a R2. We have to take help of a R1. For R2, it is minus one. So here we will be writing it as a plus one. Similarly, R3 will be equal to this. Will be your R1. So this is your plus three. So here we have to take minus three R1. So let me perform now this each and every. Uh, let me perform this equation on each and every column. So this will be one zero zero. Now there is no need to have any change in R1. So I am going to write it this as it is. So it will be your four. This is as it is. Now first perform this equation. on this column so what is r2 2 plus 1 into what is r1 minus 0.2 so what you will get 2 minus 0.2 will be equal to 1.5 so this will be your 1.5 perform the same equation on this column in this column what is r2 it is 1 plus 1 into 1.5 so if you do 1 plus 1.5 you will get it as 2.5 Perform here on this particular column. So R2 will be equal to. Let me write it here. 8 plus R1 is 4. So 8 plus 4 will be equal to 12. Now we will perform this R3 equation on each and every column. So for this column, if you see what is R3, it is 1 minus 3 into R1 is minus 0.5. So if you perform this on a calculator. you will be able to get answer as 2.5 so this will be equal to 2.5 again perform same equation on third column so in the third column we have r3 is minus 4 minus 3 into 1.5 so if you do it minus 4 minus 3 into 1.5 you will get answer as minus 8.5 similarly perform for this particular column what is r3 0 minus 3 into r1 is Four. So four into three, it will be equal to twelve, but it is minus twelve. Now next is what we have to do in a step number three. We will be we will be making this element R two, that is one point five, as a one. So we have to write it as R two will be equal to R two divided by one point five. Remaining thing you have to write it as it is. So it will be one zero zero. This will be your minus zero point five as it is. 1.5 as it is this will be your 4 no need to do any changes because we are doing operation only on row 2 
so therefore row 3 will be same minus 12 so here it will be 1 now if you do 2.5 divided by 1.5 so what you will get you will get answer as 1.6666 okay and r2 that is 12 divided by 1.5 so you will get this answer as a 8 now with the help of this element that is r2 we have to make this element as a 0 and this element as a 0 so let me write it here step number 4 so what we will do we have to make changes in a r1 with the help of r2 so here we will be writing plus 0.5 similarly we have to make changes here in a r3 with the help of r2 so here it will be minus 2.5 so let me write this now i will apply these equations here so it will be 100 0, 0. this will be 0 1 0 now i am going to keep this 1.6666 as it is and this 8 will be as it is now perform this first line or first equation for this particular column what is r1 here 1.5 plus 0.5 into what is r2 1.6666 so let me do this what is the answer 1.5 plus 0.5 into 1.6666 so you will get answer as this will be 2.3333 so this is the answer again perform to this column now r1 is what 4 plus 0.5 into r2 is 8 so 4 plus 0.5 into 8 you will get this answer as a 8 only next is we, we will be applying this r3 equal to r3 minus 2.5 r2 uh, to these columns so if you see for this column what is r3 it is minus 8.5 minus 2.5 into 1.6666 so let me do it minus 8.5 minus 2.5 into bracket 1.6666 so you will get answer as minus 12.6665 again apply to this particular column last column so what is r3 minus 12 minus 2.5 into r2 is 8 so minus 12 minus 2.5 into 8 so what you will get you will get answer as minus 32 now next is what we have to do in a step number 5 we have to make this element as a 1 so what we will do r3 will be equal to r3 divided by minus 12.6665 so let me write these equations as we are not doing any changes in a R1, so I am going to write this R1 as it is. There will be no change here. And R2 also we will be writing it as it is. That is here 1.6666. It will be 8. This is 0. This is 0. We are making it to, we are doing this step to make this as a 1. Now apply this to this particular column. So what is your R3? Minus 32 divided by minus 12.6665 so what you will get you will get answer as here 2.5263 so let me write it here 2.5263 now with the help of this in a step number 6 what we have to do we have to make these two elements 0 with the help of these elements so I am writing it as R1 will be equal to R1 we have to take help of R3 in R1 we have plus 2.333 so here we are going to write it as minus 2.333 similarly R2 will be equal to R2 minus 1.6666 into R3 so let me apply this so after applying what we will get 100 010 001 now this will be as it is 2.5263 this will be as it is no need to change here now apply this first formula to this column so r1 is 8 minus 2.3333 into r3 is 2.5263 so let me apply this 8 minus 2.3333 into bracket 2.5263 so what we will get we will get here answer as 2.1053 and now we have to apply this r2 minus 1.6663 into r3 to this column so what is r2 8 minus 1.6666 r3 will be what here if you see r3 will also be same so it will be equal to what if you see 
2.5263. So let me do this. 8 minus 1.6666 into bracket 2.5263. So what you will get here? You will get answer as 3.7896. So here, if you carefully observe, what is the value of I1? Here I1 will be equal to 2.1053 ampere. I2 will be equal to 3.7896 ampere and I3 will be equal to 2.5263 ampere. So this is what is a solution of Gauss Jordan method. If you have any doubt, please feel free to ask any questions. Thank you.